Hello and welcome to my Yu-Gi-Oh channel. Today we're looking at a new box which is introduced within Yu-Gi-Oh Rush Jewels and this is meant to support the main character Yuga alongside his maximum support spellcasters. So I've actually already covered his maximum monster. I'll leave that actually in the card that you'll see up above, uh, which is showing now. And that will give you a full explanation of how the effects work and my opinions of them. And we'll actually look at this brand new card, which is called Amazing Dealer. It's a level 3 water attribute spellcaster type effect monster with 0 attack and 1000 defense. The requirement, if there are 3 or less monsters in your graveyard, you can pay 300 life points. The effect is to choose 3 cards from your hand and send them to the graveyard. Then you draw 3 cards. I think this card is actually quite useful. It does have quite a restrictive requirement on it to have 3 or less monsters in your graveyard because you are going to have to use this almost immediately within your turns as soon as you draw into it, or you could potentially draw into it far too late to be able to activate, or you're going to have to use something where you can pot of avarice your monsters so that you can have three or less to meet the condition. The 300 life point cost is so minimal it's not going to make a difference actually. I'd argue the effect is so good. 300 points is, you know, not bad. I wouldn't have been surprised if it had been 1,000 or 2,000 life points as the cost. It does require you to choose three cards from the hand and just send them to the graveyard. That's fine. They don't have to be spell, trap, or monsters. They can be any mixture of each. There aren't any other requirements. And then you just instantly draw three cards. The main benefit of this means that if you've got a very, you know, bad hand, you're just able to use this effect, get rid of those cards, and then potentially draw into three more useful cards. It's similar to Graceful Charity, except actually you're going you're going neither plus one or minus, you're going neutral. And since this is in a monster effect, that means at least you keep the monster, whereas with Graceful Charity, it being a normal spell card, it alongside with everything else has to go to the graveyard. I think this is something that can actually be splashed into a number of decks. It's not specific to Yuga, even though it alleges to be alongside this. What do you guys think of this card? Is this something you can consider running, or do you think it's quite forgettable? Whatever you think, leave your opinions down below. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe for more daily Yu-Gi-Oh! content.